uh, this one, Pirate Quartermaster, is set to come out uh, uh, October 2nd. It's supposed to be here. It's on Itch. It's also on uh, on Steam here. And we have a demo. So that's what we're going to be playing today um, and, and checking out. So this one is a lot more detailed than I than I first thought uh, just by just by looking at the thing. And I just opened up the wrong game. Okay, okay. So we will, um, we, we, shall, we shall be a pirate. A pirate quartermaster. We're not a captain. A pirate quartermaster. Um, we're going to do a, uh, a new game here. And check it out. The loading is the waves of the boat. Very nice. Very impressive. Okay, we got one uh, mission that we can do, which is the slave's son. And a life one hand chained to your mother, other one to a goat. We need for a few hours later, uh, time to sign a contract that sends you to another owner living in Anatoa. So, uh, eventually we leave our cage, we make our way out, we seize a ship uh, with no guards, and eventually we become a, uh, a pirate. We start at sea with a crew of seven inexperienced men, has a good relationship with the captain, has a degraded relationship with the uh, the slave people that has more strength and resistance than the other characters. Okay. My first name is... Um, Untinti Nook is my name. And we're going to do a tutorial. Because this one is a... Uh, um, it's a, it's pretty detailed. And there's a lot going on here, so we gotta we'll take it, we'll take it easy, and we'll, we'll figure this thing out. So Mr. Nook, I am captain of the ship. Let's say I'm the boss around here. Okay, but it will be up to you, as the quartermaster, to make me a good boss by advising or con contradicting me. Always keeping the interest of the crew in sight. As a matter of fact, you will be in charge of everything concerning the organization and maneuvering of the ship. Here are the sailors that stand bes beside us in this journey to freedom. They are dividing into two teams, taking turns for each watch. There's a uh, there's six watches, means half and half. Uh, watches, uh, except during battle, will represent turns. Any action done by a sailor will only be effective after you rang that bell. Put an end to the current watch, and therefore the application of the intended actions. In battle, different story. We'll get that when we get there. Okay, flag represents the morale of the crew, The uh, that one. The, the higher it goes, the more happy people are, the lower, not so much. Um, a man may feel wronged, and overall morale may still be good. So from time to time, sailors will speak out loud, telling you how they feel. Sometimes you can even deduce their personalities from it. Morale of the crew is an important factor, because the morale is in decline for too long, could lead us to <gasps> a mutiny. We don't want this, now do we? You no, no, no. As for me, according to my attitude, the less attention I pay to you, the less I trust you. But I have faith in you. I will let you influence my decisions, but if you disappoint me too many times, I'll make sure you don't disappoint me ever, ever again. Alright, now it's the time to introduce you to the pirate code. Give us all the rules to follow when evolving in this crew. I wrote it myself, because I think I have the experience required for it. We'll change it later if it doesn't fit. Read it carefully, then sign. Yeah, we, we ain't reading. <laughs> So we can, we can, like, zoom in and read things if we want. Uh, a sailor who steals provisions or gold will be condemned to death. Sign away. Okay. It's, it's like, it's like, a, it's like, um, well, we'll see, we'll see. Get to know your ship or crew and her laws because you will sometimes have to act and judge without having access to the information. Can you imagine a superior who doesn't know the rules? Outrageous. Uh, it's time to hit the sea, Mr. Nook. Click right on one of the men, on uh, one of the men, and give him to the rigging. So you, sir, with a nose, to the rigging. Okay, unfurl the sail. We gotta click it. Or hit V. We'll click it. Uh, there we go. Now open the map, and we can go, or click on that, and go to the map. So we are down there. Oh, strange. It's a, oh, uh, it's a procedurally generated map. I played this before, and I was, it was a different world. Interesting. Uh, here we are. Red circle is our position. Thin black line represents our viewing area, which is this little guy here. Okay. Uh, I believe you know this item. It's a compass. Red is the wind direction, and uh, the other one is is us, our current heading. So let's rotate it, and let's sail this way, shall we? So that X is where we're going to get, but in, in one watch, we're going to get to that X, which is nowhere. Okay. Now we have at least a man at the rigging. Uh, uh, and have set a direction. This direction needs to be kept. To do that, we need a man at the helm. Otherwise, the ship will wander freely. So pick a guy to go to the helm, which is going to be you with the hair. To the helm. Something in the air. Can you feel it? it? Smells like a merchant ship. We should better get ready to fight. Start by clicking the organization sheet and pressing O. Okay. So here you have to keep an eye on the scuttle butt. Fresh water supply. The longer you keep the water, the more stagnant. Therefore, the greater the risk your sailor is getting sick. We don't want that. I uh, also have access to various compartments on the ship where the uh, the wood is stored, the alcohol is stored, the uh, the food is stored, all that stuff is in there. Got it. Add a sick bay. Okay. 
We'll do that. We'll pop that one in down uh, down down this way. There we go. We got a sick bay in the front. Have a look at the guns. We can move two from port to starboard. So we'll grab this guy, pop him over here, and we'll put this guy over here. Okay. Apply changes. Got it. Yeah. Now you can see the sick bay has been set up. There's a sick bay down there now. Guns have been moved. We can always zoom in. <laughs> sick bay. Throw him overboard. Put the remaining man on the lookout and increase our chances of spotting a ship. So, uh, you with a hat to the lookout. All right. Access your information by left-clicking on your character. So there's me. Oh, I look different, too. This is where you can choose the clothes, weapons, and whatever you wish to wear. So I would like to wear... Can I do it now? Also order a, a weapon for boarding. Weapons have different impacts. impacts. Um, equip yourself with a weapon. Is that me? I would like to have... Ooh, a musket. I don't know how the musket works. I do know how the sword works. I'm going to take a sword. That's all randomized, also. Um, can I change my, my stuff? I can change my shoes. Shoes or no shoes. That's all we got, though. I am a, I'm a poor defender and a bad shot. Excellent. I know nothing about diseases, it says. Time's come to prepare our men for battle. Left click on a sailor, sailor to display his descriptive sheet. So, this guy. On the sheet, you can see several pieces of information about uh, Fofof Azafos, is his name. Um, he's on board since zero. He has the he has charisma kind as the mustache of the carp. I'm sure that means great. Okay. The uh, more we talk about him, the more we'll learn about this guy. Give him a weapon. Uh, here you go, buddy. Have yourself... You know what? You can have a musket. To find a position for that sailor he'll take when we get attacked. So, um, we want him to go to the rigging. Okay, so he'll go to the rigging. So when battle ensues, he goes to the rigging. Okay. Equip a weapon and assign a combat position to each of the seven men. One sailor at the helm, two at the rigging, four at the guns. Got it. So we'll take... He's at the rigging, so we'll put you... Uh, what was it? Two in the rigging? So you can go to the... I'm going to give you a, a dagger and put you on the helm. Okay. Uh, you up there. Um, I'll give you a... Um, an axe. And you can go to the rigging also. And then all you guys in here sleeping. Some daggers go around. We can give them multiple weapons. I don't think we have enough for that, though. And we'll put you on... What was it? The... Uh, the Helm rigging and what? Helm two rigging, four at the guns. At the guns. Okay. And you, you're going to be at the guns with a dagger. And you. At the guns. Get yourself uh, uh, an axe. And then we got the last guy. Is it you? Who is it? You? You. Uh, to, the, to the guns with a shield. Okay, all set. Press W, double click the watch bell. In the watch. Uh, Ace Dup Goofagupal says a vessel to port. She's flying a yellow flag. She's a steam merchant. Steam merchant cabin ship. According to the lookout, compared to our ship, enemy has fewer guns and fewer men. The water line is low. The force of the wind is five knots. There you go. Merchant ship. Excellent. Uh, I can read several pieces of information related to this encounter because we have someone on the lookout. Okay, thanks, Captain. The decision is required. Should we attack her or let her go? I want to attack. Well, do you agree? Let's say you want to contradict me. No, no, no. We're fine. We're fine. Next to the word contradict, you see a number that indicates how many contradictions I'm bound to listen to. It depends on how much I trust you. I no longer have any guaranteed... I think my mouse, my mouse just died. I think my mouse just died. <laughs> Great. Uh, it's one of those days. Hey. Hey. All right. All right. All right. All right. So next to the word contradict. Uh, so we can contradict him one time. Uh, the... Um, if you no longer have any contradictions, there's a good chance I'm going to blow you off. They're reviewed every day. Okay, so we'll contradict him. Uh, and why? I'm not an easy person, Mr. Nook. When someone contradicts me, he has to convince me. Uh, well, uh, it would tarnish our relationship with, with, with the yellas. Are the hole in the sails in good condition? Do we have enough melee men, guns, cannonballs, and wood? Aren't we going to tarnish our relations with his people and take a step? Yeah, yeah. Which do you think would be more convincing? The uh, tarnishing one, of course. <clears throat> and hell freezes over, he says. Either way. Even if I had been the right answer, I would have said no. Let's attack her. Okay. Okay, Captain. Here we go. Okay. Now, time for a change of game. So this is this is this is things change. This it's, it's different. So here we go. When a fight is launched, the rhythm changes. Thanks, Captain. You're no longer in peaceful cruising mode where the management prevails. You're in a situation of emergency, where you have to manage orders and assignments in real time. You understand now why I had you assign battle positions to the man in advance because if the battle goes well, it's properly if it's properly prepared. Got it. You can see the ship far ahead. 
goal is to salvage its cargo. If we sink her, we only get part of it. But if we board her, we expose ourselves to the possible greater loss of men. At the beginning of the fight, the direction of the ship is important because it defines the direction she must go to flee or to come closer. So, direction of her bow is the way she has to take to move towards us. So she has to go that way. Okay, got it, got it. On the other hand, that of her stern is the direction of the seaward. If she goes beyond this point, we'll lose her. So we don't want to go that way. Okay. In this situation, our two ships are looking at each other and therefore we'll get closer. Enemies attacking, trying to get away. If the, uh, the bows are in the same direction, it means that one of us is chasing the other. Since the enemy is fleeing, it means we're chasing them. Okay, on your left. Ready for this? We st we st are you still with me? we got a list of orders that we can do. So we can fire, right? Fire weapons. Uh, we can reload the guns. We can get down, take cover. We can gibe, jibe. I'm not sure what that one is. It's maybe, maybe jibe sounds right, but I think it's probably gibe. I don't know. Orders the sailor at the helm to tack, which means to bring her about. Turn around, basically. Okay? And we have the three spots that we can fire at. And we have the three different kinds of, of, uh, of munitions to fire. It's a hard G, gibe. Is that what it is? Don't forget, I'm the captain, and I'm the one who gives the orders. All along the way, I'll give you a hard time, and it'll be up to you to have carried the orders out by my men. Enemy ship has machines in a more than has machines in a more than questionable condition. Bring on the run. Be clever to break them and catch up with her. Machines, I guess. I don't know. Express an order. You have to type it out. Typing time. Typing time on the keyboard quickly without error. Aim for her engine. So we say we say the machines. If you stammer when giving an order, you lose time. You'll have to type faster and neater before I say new order. If I tell you a new one before you have succeeded and repeat it, I'll be disappointed. Don't disappoint the captain. If I have to repeat myself, I'll get impatient and I'll be disappointed as well. If you dare give another one instead, I will, of course, be disappointed. My disappointment, one might say, is looming over you. Now that our gunners have nowhere to aim, we shall fire. Fire! Okay. Fire! Fire the guns. After you fire, the guns will get hot. You have to wait a moment to reload. Otherwise, they might break. Load those cannons. Okay. See our gunners. They are uh, two per gun in battle. One carries the swab and reloads. The other carries the blaster and lights the fuse. The blaster, like a stormtrooper. The enemy will probably be firing soon. Get ready. When I tell you to take cover, be quick. Okay. Get cover. What? I spelled it wrong. It's get cover, right? Oh, it's get down. Get down. Whoops. Not having time to say get down will not cost you my trust because it's a spontaneous order. It can be avoided if the enemy cancels his order and take cover himself. I will often pronounce it over another order. So pay attention to first order. That will appear briefly. Let's get it, it over with her machines. Okay. Fire the guns! Look, the guns are still red. they got to wait till they cool down. Okay. Uh, fill the guns. Reload! We're going to deal her with her planking. I mean the hole, the ob obviously. The hole! I spelled it wrong! The hole. Aim. Fire! Wait till she's reached the end of her C. Okay, 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 okay. Let's reload. Oh. Once she reaches the end of her C level, she moves to the next C level in the opposite direction. Got it. If we don't guide fast enough, she'll go back to the previous C. So we want to attack the ship. Flip her around. Okay, grape shot. Fire! Okay, someone's singing. Load the cannons. Uh, get down! Oh, I spelled it wrong! <laughs> get down. Uh, fire! There you go. Okay, reload. Uh, reload. Uh, get down. Okay, fire! Okay. Re oh, oh, oh. Reload. Fire! Lay fi what? You said... Captain, you're very confusing. Turn around. Okay. We got him. We got him now. We got him. Fire. I didn't reload, Captain! Fire! Cannonballs. What are we using? We're using wrap. Okay, repair, prepare for boarding. Alright, boarding's begun. We're gonna have to fight, Mr. Nook. All right, so you can move around by using A and D. Got it. Uh, the red circle on top of you represents your resistance. If it's completely empty, well, no need to spell it out for you. Thanks, Captain. Each man who fights is more or less strong, depending on resistance, strength, and ability to parry. Enemies carry a small banner over their back so they can get identified. Moreover, it's impossible to hit your own allies. All right, so attack with your first weapon by using left click. And uh, act more effectively with shields. Got it, got it, got it. 
during boarding, each blow you strike has a risk of destroying your weapon. That's why it's good to have two. Okay, so we're gonna go in here and swing and swing. And just, you know, just sort of... Oh, and we can jump on onto the other ship if we want to. And hack and slash and, uh, and, uh, you know, just sort of do that. Victory! Okay, condition of the man. So we've got nothing to report for me and, and him. And oh, oh no, no. Uh, Adek Soup Fugpa. He lost his right hand. That's okay. He gets a hook now. It means him makes him even more terrifying. Uh, we lost a musket in the fight. We uh, we got some daggers and a sword. We also got some booty. So here's a battle report. On the left, we have the summary of the wounds, the sailors, and all that. On the right, we have all the stuff that we can loot. Take everything you can get away from her. Letting her go has less of a negative impact on our relationship with the people involved and its allies than sinking her. In order to damage our relationship, if she sunk, they have to know about it. That's right, that's right. So we're going to take some guns. Load up both sides over here. Might as well load us, load us down here. And we've got uh, we got a ton of water. We'll take them to put in our, our scuttlebutt. we got five drugs. Uh, we've also got some alcohol we can throw into the... Uh, Alcohol tanks there. The food was going to go into the food spot. And we got some gold. If that gold is full, the, the it's empty. So it's, we got to put a new gold spot in. And we're taking almost a ton of gold. Uh, we have some hammocks we can put in, but no, worry, no worries about that. Okay. Taking the lead on this one. It'll take us to the nearest town. Okay. Thanks, Captain. Reach the city. This is where we can hope to make some dough, but... Here comes the merchant. He's on duty from dawn to dusk, but exceptionally today for us, he stays up late. Let's trade with him some goods so we can leave with the holds fold. All right, click on him. Need some goods? I'm clicking on him. Okay, there we go. Uh, on the left side, we have what we can buy and sell over there, uh, and it'll show up over this side. Okay, so we want to buy... You want me to sell two tons of goods and buy two tons. Okay. Um, I will sell you... I don't know... Um, I'll sell you some uh, some wood. I feel, I feel like I need that. We've got we've got four tons of food. I'll sell you some food, and I I'll sell you some. What do we get from there? We got a lot of. We got some alcohol. I'll sell you some alcohol, and then I will buy from you. Oh, I don't know. You want me to buy two two tons of things? Can I have another gun? No. I said you have one. Maybe I don't have enough money for that. Um. I will buy some fabric. And I'll buy some, uh, some, some, some. I'll buy some wood, I guess. Okay, merchant updates transaction form on the right. You have to sign to validate. I'll sign by Mr. Nook. Four tons are getting moved. Understood. Sign it. You're gonna have to move the goods, so that you can see here and there. And right-click on the interactive man and sign him to the docks. Right-click on an inactive man. You? That's me. Sign him to the docks. To the docks. Okay, one man can carry up to two guns per watch. Put two men on the docks to carry the goods over being traded in a single watch. If we leave a town without hauling everything while the merchant owes us gold, he won't give us anything. Okay. Also, he'll refuse to deal with us. So you, go into the docks, buddy. Note the cobwebs. The lower the hygiene, the more mold on the decks and webs and the compartments. The dirty ship can cause disease. Attract rats. Okay, we need someone to uh, get this boat in, uh, in ship shape. To the cleaning. Ton of gold will be seven million dollars at today's prices. <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Uh, at the tavern, you can see your sailors resting during stops in town. They feast and squander their fortunes. As long as they have gold, everything goes well and the morale rises. On the other hand, if they find themselves without funds, they settle down in their hammocks and mope. Keep an eye on that. Okay, the tavern. Sometimes one or several people waiting for an opportunity to sail away. If they're interested, they will apply for joining the group. Click on a recruit. Hey, buddy. See a uh, nice, nice hair. On the left, you see the pirate code. Right, that we have to sign. On the right, gives a brief description of him. Do those do not like to shilly-shally? Up to you to hire him, if he has a place in this crew. Hello, sir. If you're looking for uh, some sailors, my name's Uzvo Kennywax. Simple machinist. Sure, you're hired, buddy. You may, if you wish, give him a nickname. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. What's what's his name? His name's, um... His name's Bert. That's a pirate name, right? As you can see, he has joined the crew. Hey, CJ. We should take advantage of this stop in town and fill the scuttlebutt. This is the ship's fresh water supply, so it's a crucial element. So I set out of the well and fills the scuttlebutt. So, hey, you with the hair. To the, um... To the what? 
to the well. Look at all those sparks working. Isn't it pleasing? It is kind of pleasing, Captain. I found a map in a dusty box. Let's take a look at it. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's where we have to put a cross. Where is that? Where? Right there? If you disagree, you can contradict me. No, that's not... No, it's no, it's not tucked up there. It could be there. No, I don't... No, that's not it, Captain. So just a spot on the map. Go ahead. Uh, well, it looks looks more... It's got like a little face to it. It looks more... It looks more like this one. It could be that one, I guess. What do you think it is? This looks identical. I think it's... I think... He thinks it's that one, but I think it's this one. I don't know why. I just got a hunch. Like, I, those are identical. I don't know above it pulls it to the right more. The only difference is... This little spot up here... That one does kind of curl up, and this one doesn't. So, yeah, I think he's okay. So, I think it's over here, Cam. Cam, I think it's right over here. Yep, right there, Cam. All right. So, uh, next objective, this will be, uh, there will be ten voters. Destination, treasure map, a city where to sell our goods, a ship to plunder. Now you know what, we, what you need to know. Learn from your failures. Seek to better manage the ship. Build an unshakable crew, sail, wander, and achieve our goals. Okay, Cam. Four votes for the map, two for the city, four for the ship. Map wins. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Why would you go for the map? You took clothes from the enemies during the last boarding. I sure did. Able to consult your quartermaster's book of knowledge at any time, except in combat, by clicking on it and pressing S. Okay. Right there. Uh, that. Oi. Man. You go to school for this. Okay. Okay, Captain. That's that guy. Um, these are these are my people. He's got an axe. This guy doesn't have a gun. Doesn't have a weapon, does he? I think I got something for you, though. Not you. I want the other one. The other one. I want you. Why don't you take yourself a dagger, buddy? Uh, and where am I at? I'm here, right? I would like. Oh yeah, yeah. Give me a hat. What the hell I get? Okay, fine. I'll have that. It's a good hat. Give me a nice puffy shirt. Some trousers. Sure. And, uh, and, no, no, I go barefoot. I'll have a second weapon. I want, I want, uh, I want two swords. There we go. Okay, Captain. Do we, um, get out of here? Are we full? Captain, did you what? Okay, to the map, Captain. Um, I suppose we gotta go before 18 watches. Okay, we're gonna go there, Captain. Um, let's go to... What was that? that was a, what was that key to uh, to help me out? S? Oh, there's steamships in the game. Okay, okay. That's the machines. Um, yeah, we wanna go that way. So I suppose... Oh, there's all kinds of things here. Man, look at all this. Okay, okay, okay. Um... Let's get out of here. Okay. A raft blackened by fire, carried by an almost unconscious man. After we get him on board, he gave him some water. He proposes us to join the crew. Thank you, sir. My name's Yutzo. I'm a humble machinist. Do you think it's possible to join your crew? Yeah, sure, buddy. What's your name? Your name is, uh, your name's Jimmy now. I was broken to obey. The first direct decision I made was to set myself free. Now that I'm living the life I waited for, I feel lost. Yeah. Fortunately, I'm not alone. This crew will allow me to adapt to this completely different life. I'd like to find the man who put me in that cage. This is my story. Okay. Lower the sails. I need, uh... Oh, I need you to the, uh... To the lookout. I need you on the rigging. And I need you on the, uh... On the helm. And, um... You back there, why don't you get to the get to fishing, I guess. There we go. Um, and let's get the sails down. And let's go, yeah, this way. Shall we? The wind, we're going against the wind. 
but that's fine. Okay, and then we just do this. Okay, we got 38 rations of food, 5 tons of water. Ration of food is, is one portion each. Sure. Um, I don't know what that means. But yeah, distribute it out. Okay. If I have to die today, I'd be satisfied with my life. Build soup. Okay. Do I have to do this every time? Let's take a look at... Oh, we got something on cleaning. Hey, you. Go get some cleaning done. Uh, I need you... Um, stick to the lookout, buddy. People get some bored. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you to the cleaning, and then you to the helm. You're cleaning already. Uh, we need someone on the uh, the rigging, right? Where's everyone at? He's sleeping. You back there, to the rigging. Thanks, Captain. Was it V to do the sails? There we go. Captain, can I talk to you? No. Hey, mobster. Hey, Shrek. Okay, let's uh, let's make sure we're on course here. We're going the wrong way. Let's go. Why are we going the wrong way? We want to go that way. No, but not that way. Why is it backwards? No, we want to go this way. Why are we going that way? We don't want to go that way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting confused. Uh, I'm just going to mark it and see what happens. I, I want to go over here. Captain. Oh, was the, was the compass turned? Uh, a leak drowned the ship's bottom. The sticky moisture has damaged the hull and deteriorated the hygiene. Some of the food that was right rotted away. We lost eight, almost eight tons. All right. Eight tenths of a ton of it. Okay. Okay. Is that down here? Can we get someone to repair that? Let's go repair some things. And uh, you're on that. We just need someone on the rigging. Where's everyone else? We got people sleeping in here. Uh, here, let me give you a dagger. And you're going to be on the on the repairs if we're fighting. Okay. That guy's happy. And you got your axe. Okay. You don't have a spot to go, so I'm going to put you on the um, the lookout. Up there, whenever people come. Okay, we need someone on, on rigging. So, um... I can't do that. You, with the repairs. Not you. You. To the rigging. Take a look at our map here. Oh, wait, oh. I see... I see. So we're going to go around the long way, I think. <laughs> so north is this way. I see, I see, I see. No matter what, we're ending up in that spot. Is that a town there? Anaroa White. Sure, let's go there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, ding. Stay in town for four watches. We'll leave before noon. What's your opinion? Um, four watches. Alright. Nothing really to do here except for get some repairs done, I guess. So, to the well. Get our water restored. Uh, you're cleaning things up. Is that what you're doing over there? If not, go do it. And, how's our food looking? Where's, like, our, our report? Our treasury. What's going on over there? Organization of the ship. Okay. Add a ton of alcohol. Sure. Yeah, fill that thing up. Do we put... Do we, I don't know. Uh, okay. You don't have a gun? Uh, I have a dagger. Oh, yeah, always oh, missing the hand. That's right. Okay. <laughs> we have a starboard crew and a port crew. All right. Uh, well, that was fun. Let's get out of here. No one to trade with here. Complications with the city's big shots. I take six men with me to settle the case. You all right with that? Sure, Captain. You go do what you need to do. You got weapons? 
here on repairs. You guys don't want to don't want to join me. All right, all right. Um, we doing everything clean. We looking okay. You stop sitting there. Why don't you uh, do some repairs? How'd it go, Captain? Is he here? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Um. As far as I know, the bell didn't ring. Well, it did now. Jimmy was slain during the fight. Oh, Jimmy. Captain had taken six men with him to solve his problem with the city's big shot. Apparently, he managed to gain respect, but only recovered part of his gold. Fortunately, one man died in the matter. It was poor Jimmy. And he was the new guy. All right, Captain. Um, I think we're ready to go. What does it mean, add a, uh, a ton of alcohol? I'm not sure. Our water's getting a little old. We should have someone on the well, though. Okay, can we get out of here now, Captain? Okay. Saw a vessel to port. She's flying a white flag. She's sailing merchant cabin ship. Force the winds five knots. Is it worth it? It certainly is worth it, Captain. Uh, I don't know. One portion, and then, and then I guess... You can have more, because we're uh, getting a little old. Which happened? Six away. Yeah, yeah. Um, is it on our map? Where was it? Where was the the ship? I don't know where that ship is. That's that's not it. That's another town over there. We gotta get this way. Let's go. Um, I guess we can, we can go. Where's north? I'm not getting anywhere out of here. <laughs> Maybe because this isn't down. You to the rigging, and uh, you to the lookout, and you to the to the helm. Lower the sails. Look okay, at now we're getting somewhere. That's against the wind, which is why it's not going anywhere. We're never gonna make it over there. Let's just go north, where the wind's going. Let's just go where, this, where the wind takes us. Thief. Sidious saw a vessel to port. Flying a gray flag, she's a steam merchant. Captain ship, look at lookout. Enemy has fewer guns and more men. Water line's low, six knots. To port, okay? Port's left, right? Attack her shamelessly. Let's teach those greys who dominate the oceans. What do you think? I approve. Here we go. Okay. Um. Look about. Uh. That one? Target are planking for me. Uh. What's the planking? The the hole? The hole. No, you said they're planking. Captain. I am. Fire. Okay. Reload. Fire. I think we need another person on guns. I think we have two more guns than we have uh, people. Oh, we got a blast there. Fire! I said fire! Okay. Reload. I feel like this is like a... It's like a typing game. Uh, nope. I didn't do that good enough. Reload. Fire! 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 We got down. Let's reload. Fire! Okay, what do you get down? Nice. We're getting blasted here. Load the cannons. I'm working on it. I got Okay. Reload. Yeah, there's a big hole in the bottom of our ship. <laughs> Seems like a bad idea. Get, get down, everybody. Okay, I said get down. I spelled it wrong. They escaped us. No, they didn't. How'd they get away? They have to go the other way to get away from us. All right, we need to get somebody. He's on repairs already. He's cleaning. Um, a little shabby there, Captain. How do we see the um the notes? 
Something here seems okay. Probably seems like the repairs and all that needed. Alright, so we want to go... We're just keep on heading north. What's that, west? Let's just keep on going north here. We'll, um... Put you on the rigging. You're on the, uh... On the helm. We probably, have, we probably don't need someone to look at, I guess. Boy, look at that. Look at that thing. Captain, what do we do? Okay. Nation understands nothing. It has a way of thinking that I don't like, and it believes it's the right one. That's the way of all nations, you tell me, but it's the one I come from that I blame. Let's sink the and plunder three of its ships. Okay. Okay. Now, if I tell you, whenever we're... Maybe we need someone to be... More people be on the guns. Because we have more guns. What do you do when we go in a fight? You go to the rigging. What are you doing? Fishing? You're on repairs. You know what? Instead of that, why don't you go to the guns. And you get on the... Uh, get on some repairs. And you stop fishing. Let's get some repairs up. Okay, Captain. Lower the sail. Oh, no one's on the rigging. Uh, you. On the rigging. Lower that. Keep on heading north. And... Away we go. Ship move forward. Luminous dots appear in her wake. It's plankton. I was told in any case it should show that we'll raise men's morale. Fish come to feed on it. Let's catch them. Okay. To the fishing. To the fishing. And you're working on the um, the rigging, right? Work on that rigging. He's cleaning. Nobody sailing this thing. We're just going to keep on going north, though. We're going to just follow the wind. And um, we probably need someone on, on the... Uh, I, I can't do it, though. That guy's fishing. Maybe just one person fishes. The other person is on the helm. We have... Is that spiderwebs? Is that what that is? Yeah, there's a bunch of them. Hey, uh, are you cleaning th clean things faster? <laughs> it's the anchor. That's my microphone. the anchor. Okay. Where are we at now, Captain? Still with the wind. Sure, we'll go this way. We're going to try to make our way to that. So the crew wants to go. Um, if I just do this again. A wandering board overhung by the chest of a man holding an imprisoned pendant waved at us. After we hoisted him up on the deck, he asked to be part of the crew. Excellent. My name is Vadav Baukas. I'm a topman. Also a machinist. Do you think it's possible to join your crew? It sure is. What's your name? Your name's Jimmy 2. Don't ask about Jimmy 1. All right, it's time to eat. Give you a portion of food, and you get some water. Okay. Um, you on the rigging. You're on the uh, the helm already. Perfect. Uh, you are going to be on the lookout. Lower that. You guys just stay on your job, I tell you. He's cleaning, which I believe is nest. Look at all these spider webs. He's fishing. I don't remember where we see the, where our, our boat is looking as far as... There it is. We have... We're getting a little low on food. Maybe... We get a second fisherman if we can, but we... He, he, he's, who's that guy? What's he doing? To the fishing. Okay. No one on the, uh, the rigging. Is that who that was? Alright. Rigging. Lower those things. Let's not go into the coast. Like that's probably good. It says one of his belongings had been stolen by someone. It's forbidden to hit a call co co to hit a colleague on a ship. So oh Fulfav, follow him the sailor. He spoke badly of my mother. Mm. If I have to die, write me in a black flag, he says. Um 
What'd you do? You hit him? You hit the guy? We talked about your mother. I mean, you don't talk about a man's mother, especially a guy with a pipe. Let him be. Disapproved by the captain. Men do not seem convinced. This guy, he fought with another sailor. Lashes, buddy. Ten lashes. Captain approves of that one. Okay. The morale is, I guess it's okay. It's, it's there. Uh, we got a guy in there. We've got food still. We've got people. Yeah, let's go make sure we're going the right way. We want to go a little bit over this way now. Like that. Hey, red cat. Okay. A debate got ugly and uh, Fikak came to blows. I can't never say it enough, but it's forbidden to hit another sailor on the ship. You. If I have to die, rat me. Lashes. Captain approves. Was hit. You were hit by another sailor. Why would I give you rat lashes? You were just hit by him. No, no just let him be. Okay. All right, we got everyone on the. Uh, you, what are you doing? Get to the the lookout. Were you my rigging guy? You were, I think. What are you doing then? You get to the rigging. What are you doing? You get to the re um, repairs. We need repairs. How about cleaning? You're on that. Okay. Keep on going that way. Sure, sure. Rats are swarming on the ship. Lack of hygiene is to blame. Disease diseases will spread further. Food will be contaminated as it goes by. Clean. I've been cleaning. Um. I guess we just say everyone clean today. You stay. You do whatever you need to do. You clean. You guys get some fishing done, and uh, we won't go very far, but we'll just sort of drift for a bit. Debate got ugly. Jimmy too came to blows. Oh, Jimmy, he's a scumbag. He deserved it. Oh, come on, Jimmy. Get all right, Jimmy. Get out of here. Disapproved by the captain. Oh, sorry, Captain. Uh, you're all right, though, buddy. Okay. I wish I could see him like sailing away. Um, should we do another round of this? Is the this is the, I'm starting to get, get this. So we've got one side that's doing one job, and this is the other side of the crew. So he's cleaning. He's working on the rigging. We got to look out. So let's sail by one set and, and then clean in the other set. We're gonna go this way. Uh, where's north? 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 This way. Is that red mean like not a good way to go because of the wind? Perhaps. Time's run out. The objective will not be achieved in time and it will be my fault, of course. Well, I went the wrong way. Did I, what do I lose? Mutiny. You're finally dead. What? Because I... <laughs> it's excruciating pain or not. No one cares and no one will remember your name. In the real game, you'll have more chance to success. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, there's Pirate Quartermaster. Uh, an interesting one. A complicated one. But uh, I think I like it.